you are no more strangers and foreigners hey but fellow citizens with the saints and of the household of god somebody shout i have access to the father look at ephesians chapter 3 verse 11 according to the eternal purpose which he proposed in christ jesus our lord in whom we have boldness and access with confidence by the faith of him so paul explained our access to the father we are no longer strangers or foreigners but fellow citizens and of the household of faith he explained that access has boldness that access is our boldness and confidence that we have by the faith of him the believer thus is one who needs no intermediary in his relating with the father no need of intermediary oh god calm down oh lord come down and manifest your power you know that song oh lord come down and manifest your power you know that song jesus come down and manifest your power you know that song send down your power we pray to you lord send down your holy ghost we say amen come holy spirit i need you come sweet spirit i pray come in your strength and your power come in your own special way i need you every day of my life I need you more than before I need so God is insolmental he gave you 30 percent now you need it to be 60 I need you every day of my life I need you I don't know how to finish it <laughs> spirit of the living God fall afresh so he has the one inside has grown old spirit of the living god fall afresh on me you know that voice on me it's a religious voice it makes you feel <laughs> god punish religion there are many of them who many of those songs come down come down come down my lord come down my savior be with us pass me not a gentle savior where is he traveling to here my humble cry <laughs> i need thee oh i need thee every hour i need thee oh bless me now my savior bless me i come to thee get born again if you are singing that song you are an unbeliever get born, born again don't worry i'll close now when, is, when i start singing songs like this know that i'm about to close <laughs> are you draw me nearer nearer my lord oh, draw me nearer nearer to thee oh my song every day father draw me nearer nearer to thee nearer to thee my song every day father draw. you see him celebrating illiteracy i will live in you and walk in you i will be your god you will be my sons and my daughters glory to god somebody shout i'm the house of god Draw me nearer, nearer, blessed Lord, to the place. Draw me nearer. Are you a goat? Draw. <laughs> Let me laugh my last laughter for 20. <laughs> glory! Ay, 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 ay. I said, glory! We know better now know better now i say we know better now i wanna be where you are dwelling in your presence facing out your table surrounded by your glory in your presence that's where i always want to want to that's where i always want to 
That's where I always want to be. <laughs> Get born again, my friend. We are come to Mount Zion. We are marching to Zion. Beautiful, beautiful Zion. We are marching upward to Zion, the beautiful city of God. <laughs> We're marching to Zion. Zion foul. The march long. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful Zion. We are marching. We are going to Zion. We are come. We are come to Mount Zion. We are right now in Zion. Zion is the heavenly Jerusalem. We are right now in the heavenly Jerusalem. Zion is the city of the living God. We are right now in the city. Kaya Dabagada. Somebody shout, I'm in the city. I refuse to live a village lifestyle. Kulutu Kulutu. The city of God. And Jesus makes the city to shine. And he lives on your inside. A number of pastors were gathered in thousands, and a man of God came to minister to them. And all of them were singing, Spirit of the Living God. Oh, these are pastors. Pastor. Pastors are crying. Spirit of the Living God. Fall afresh. I've never seen a bunch of unbelievers like that. It's shocking. How can pastors be crying for Holy Spirit to come? So what have they been carrying before? Alcohol. Alcohol. <laughs> Gin or which one? <laughs> or pami? <laughs> Pam wine. <laughs> it's the <Bible> trust. <laughs> they are crying. Spirit of the living God, what a rest. What they are saying, God, you are a liar. That's what they are saying. God, you are a big liar. You promise us that when we receive Christ, the Holy Ghost will come, but He has not come. So since you have not kept your word, now keep it. I've never seen unbelief like that. The day you got born again, Holy Ghost entered you. Listen, you don't speak in tongues before you know you have Holy Ghost. If you are born again, you have Holy Ghost. The moment you receive Christ into your heart, Holy Ghost enters. It is Holy Ghost that born you again. It is called born of the Spirit. The whole Holy Ghost is inside you, whether you speak in tongues or not. The only thing is, if you don't speak in tongues, you cannot explore the spirit life. But you have Holy Ghost. You are cheated. You are limited. You are restricted. There are realms you will not experience that are yours. That's why you speak in tongues. Then somebody asks me, is it possible for a born again believer to speak in demon tongues? No. No. Once you are born again, any tongue you speak is from God. It is because of wrong teaching. You are not taught well. That's why you have a problem speaking in tongues. The moment you are born of the spirit, the spirit lives inside you and steadily he gives you utterance he gives you utterance so the moment you find out that your mouth begins to go legato milatanaka you are responding to what is inside and the more stupid the tongues the more powerful you didn't hear what i said no you didn't hear what i said the more stupid the tongue sound the more powerful when your tongues are not sounding like english they are not sounding like Igbo. You understand? <laughs> they are not sounding like epic. <laughs> Your tongues are not sounding like Ide in Folukutala. When your tongues begin to sound like Yayi Wangi and Kanto, Nyangu and Kengali go to go. Tilato, Tulato, Tatali, Tatata. When you start sounding like that, that is where the power is more. Because he that speaketh in tongues. Speaking not unto men. No man knows what he's speaking. 
but I'll be it in the spirit. Kalama As your amen will come like thunder, move up to higher realms, higher realms of manifestation, higher realms of glory, greater realms of power, greater realms of manifestation. If your amen is louder, experience it by grace. Experience it by grace. Experience it by grace.